How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some Brawlhalla for you today as always. And we're going to be jumping into these new skins that released yesterday. I didn't get the chance to uh, play these skins yet because I was so hyped on the new cannon changes. Which are amazing. I've just been loving cannon. Uh, but we have Arctic Fox Yumiko here. Beautiful new skin. I really like the hammer skin, the Glacier Gavel. And the Voice of the Snow bow is pretty cool. But not my favorite bow either. Um, one thing to note about this Arctic Fox Yumiko skin is that she actually does have a little fox on her shoulder. And it even animates when you do different attacks. So we're going to be playing some games with her. And then we also have the Black Diamond Mordek skin. Kind of goes with the... Uh, the uh, uh, what is it? That Kaya skin with the with the ski goggles and whatnot. She, I think this one actually looks a lot like that. I could almost do like a Arctic climber strikeout if I had one more skin like that. Let me let me go into uh, into an experimental lobby here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Where is Kaya? So Kaya has this one. This skin reminds me a lot of the uh, the Black Diamond Mordex. Uh, but we're not going to be using Kaya today. We're going to be switching off between uh, Mordex and Kaya and, uh, psh, sorry, Yubiko. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and start it out with the Mordex. Here's all the colors of this skin that I have. I think I have every color for Mordex unlocked except for Skyforge and Goldforge. So I just quickly go through all the colors so you guys can see what it looks like with this skin. And uh, we're going to go ahead and start out with the classic colors just so we can get the uh, feel for what it actually looks like. And then we will use probably black and I don't know, we'll see what else we use. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. Um, I haven't warmed up with Scythe today, but I think it'll be fine. I really like this Scythe on this skin though. This is like the main reason I wanted this skin was for this reason. The pickaxe. It's like an ice, ice pick rather. All right, going against Taro Sage. Gold border, though I'm not gonna let that fool me. He's probably diamond. I usually get matched against people that are my skill when I'm in experimental. I don't think it shows you, but I'm pretty sure there's still uh, elo, even in experimental. Ooh, I should have hit him there. I actually have a uh, daily mission to get ca uh, gadget KOs. So I might be trying to get like bomb or spike ball kills or something like that. But when I when I see the opportunity, I'm not going to like fish for it too hard. Close one there. Right in the face, Mardex, with that side sig. Should I just stick with the sight that seems to be working out for me? I was uh, looking at the comments the other day and somebody said I shouldn't do the uh, hard side light as often when they're not in red. So I'm going to try to take that advice home and uh, see what I can do. Oh, GG dude, three stock. All right. I actually didn't even get touched that much. Yeah, 97 damage done. All right, maybe he was a gold. I don't know. GG dude. Uh, all right, so that was that was cool. Let's switch it off every game. So I'll, I'll do the Bardex skin and then I'll do the. Oh my goodness! Look at what that looks like in black colors. That's amazing. That's the first black skin that I've ever seen that isn't like completely black. Wow, that looks amazing. All right, we're definitely gonna use. What? Good heat wave looks so good. Oh my goodness. This might be my new favorite Yumiko skin. It's so nice looking. Even community colors, dude. Alright, we're gonna go with the uh base uh colors, like I said for the first time, but yeah. That that little Arctic wolf actually like has a scary uh angry face when I'm attacking. You probably can't see it because it's so small. Dang, this skin is nice. I like this one a lot more than the Mordex one, if I'm being honest. This one is really nice. Though the Mordex one's good too. They're both cool. 
If you guys enjoy Brawlhalla content and you're enjoying my video, please drop a like. It really helps me out. I'd be super, super pleased if we could break 100 likes during the video premiere. That's always my goal. Hammer is kind of a weak spot for me, so... I don't know why I, pl I like to play off edge so much. Oh my. I killed myself there. <laughs> I jumped and hit the bottom of the stage. Rip. Alright, I'm doing horrible, but luckily for me, I'm just getting warmed up. He's a really good gauntlet player, though, I could tell. One mistake there, he finally did. One mistake, and I finally got a, a, a stock on this guy, but he got me damaged up a little bit, so I gotta be careful about that. Oh man, that reach. <gasps> Beautiful off stage side sig with the sword. I completely forgot that was a thing with Val. That was close to being pretty cool, but it wasn't. Oh my goodness. Finally. All right. So we're in final stock, but so is uh so is Val, so. Boom, baby! One, two, three, and you're dead. GG, dude, GG. Oh man, that was a really close game. He had me on the ropes that entire game, but we came back and won, boys. That's what we do. Oh, I can't wait to try uh, this skin out with different colors, but we're gonna come back right to more decks. I actually really like that charged OG uh, color scheme. The home team looks really good as well. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with the charged OG. We'll say black for last. I'll do three games with each legend if we have time. Depends how how long the uh, games take. So last time I was board X, I really focused on the scythe, and that's honestly because I have more fun using scythes, but I'll try to use some gauntlets this time around. See how we do. Going against uh, Three, the Immortal two, Kid playing Zul. We're both using the uh, Charged OG color. Sorry, I got the scythe, so I'm just going to use it. Um, oops! I really wasn't trying to throw it. My bad. Alright, well, now we got the gauntlets. Woo, that instant gauntlet gimp. Oh my.
try to get that neutral light off. Boom, boy, B. Punch, 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 punch. Oops, not what I... <laughs> There's the new taunt. GG, dude. I think I killed him all three times with, like, gauntlet gimps. All right, so that worked out. Look at the shades on top of the goggles. <laughs> oh, man. All right, that was fun. Let's do Arctic Fox Yumiko. Oh, my goodness. There's literally so many good colors to choose from, and I'm not going to be able to use them all in this video. But they are all so beautiful. I actually didn't go... Oh, my goodness. Red looks so good, dude. I like every color I've seen so far. Oh my goodness. Wow, brown actually looks really cool as well. That looks really cool. Yellow, dude, they did such a good job with these colors. I'm like hitting you guys. They look beautiful. Yumiko. How about do CC colors? Let's do community colors. I will be dropping a community colors code in the comments after the video as well. So I hope you guys uh, pay attention after the video. Look down in the comments. And the first person to enter the code will get community colors unlocked for all legends, current Three, two, and future. One, Going to get some Manog Zalulu. Zalul. <laughs> Z Manog Zalul. Spot dodging on me, Zul. I thought I could have grabbed him right here with that neutral sig, because sometimes it will grab when they're like behind you, but guess not. That was close. Uh oh. Oh my. Alright, he's at the health to where I could probably kill him with the nice D light side air. Yep. Here it is, boys. And I'm dead. Oh my goodness, I'm still alive somehow. Oops. Kind of missed him on that neutral light there, but it's all good. Oh yeah, I need gadget kills. Oh my goodness, how did I get that? Hey, up, uh, up, uh, didn't kill him. Oh boy, I read that dodge up with that neutral sig right in his face! GG dude, GG. Alright, um, I think we got enough time. Alright, we're gonna go black with the Mordex, just because I know most people probably that's what they would like to see. Or Skyforge or Goldforge. I haven't actually seen the Skyforge or Goldforge version of this Mordex, so um, we'll look in training afterwards if I remember but yeah if you want to see like what colors or what skit like you know what I mean you can go into training and you compete you can use any skin in the game any color in the game I'm pretty sure maybe not charged OG colors but I think pretty much every color you can't like obviously use those in uh, real games but in training you can going against mystics the carry all right all right, not gonna let me get a weapon.
Dang, I was hoping he would jump. <laughs> okay, okay. And the taunt! So he attacks me when the match starts. And then he has the nerve to be taunting this much. Bro. There's a thing as winning, and then there's like winning with honor. You should learn how to do that. You know? Like if you're gonna win, win with honor. Don't be don't be rude. Don't be taking cheap shots. Which if you attack me with, before I get a weapon, that's fine. I don't consider it too much of a cheap shot, but it is kind of basically an unwritten rule in uh, Brahalla. Nice kill there. Azoth is a really good edge camping legend. All right, keep keep taunting, bro. We'll see how confident you get. Oh yeah, you getting it, boy. You getting it. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, nice one, dude. Nice one. <laughs> that was actually a good move. GG, dude. GG. I wish I wish you could learn how to be a better sport, though. Cause that was that was bad sportsmanship. Anyways, let's do one more game here with Yumiko. We're gonna go black colors and see how we do here. This one's so interesting because, like I said, it's not fully decked out in black. It's got a lot of gray to it. Let's hope that I get that guy again. I didn't even look at his name, but I'll I'll know him when I see him. The Gold Forge days off, baby. Let's have the rematch. Nah, different guy, but. I've seen a lot of Zul lately, dude. A lot of Zul. Probably because they reworked the cannon. Now everybody Two, thinks Zul's a god. One, Going against Squid Dracula. See, I always taunt immediately so they know that I'm letting them get the weapon. They know. That's the whole purpose. And uh, if you're going to see my taunt, which is a, a salute, basically, and you're not going to... All right, bro, let's start. After we get weapons, there if you're not if you're not fighting after that, I, I, I don't know what to tell you, bro. Like we're not going to wait all day. Let's fight. Let's fight. <laughs> all right. Since he was messing around, I'll kill myself so we have equal stocks, all right? Now let's fight, let's fight, let's fight. Oh, nice. Oh my goodness, that was good. That was a good one. And just like that, he took the lead. All right, Black Yumiko, we got to focus. We ain't going to lose this one. Was it worth it? Probably not. He should have only done that if I was like in deep red, because... He is reacting a little bit quicker than me, and it is paying off! <gasps> Calculated! But how did I not hit him when I'm down airing and I literally land on him? How do I, how did I not hit him with that? That was crazy. I wanna look at the replay. 
he, he kicked my butt there, so I'm not putting it against him, but... What happened here? Okay, that was sick. And then... Right here, look. Uh, I guess I was a little bit off. So was he, the... Ugh. Oh. Ah, oh, ah, oh, let's, let's show the hurt boxes and hit boxes. Yeah, I was a little bit off and he was not. Boom! <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was a good moment. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please drop a like. Uh, be sure to subscribe for more Brahala content. As always, I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Take it easy.